to the video uh, today is January 8th I believe so I'm gonna start heading over to the trainer it's about 6 20 in the morning I want to get there at about 6 30 because I've been having some knee problems as I've been saying in the previous videos um, unfortunately yesterday I tried pushing through I was on first day of static um, it was hurting a lot in the warm-up and it was like the first 30 minutes luckily I was able to get through all of that but it was just a lot of pain and I knew that I wouldn't be able to get through the games and I just hinder the team a little bit so I decided to go off and I told the coach so I went to the trainer and they said it was kind of the same thing that my physical therapist said back in, in Arlington Heights so I just said so he just said that I'll be back in like a couple of days. So that's the good news. I'll be back in a couple of days. But I just got to get to these, get to the trainers after school and before school. And of course, during practice. And maybe I'll even do the warm ups, keep on doing those um, to just keep active and stuff. So when I get back, I'm not totally behind when it comes to training. So I'm going to go over there right now. Um, I'll try and record me going there. I probably won't get clips inside because I just need to focus on recovering my knee. But I'll tell you guys what I do afterwards. Um, so yeah, I'm going to start heading over there right now and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, just got back from the trainer and from eating breakfast. Um, it was pretty good. My knee is actually feeling really good right now. Um, the only thing that I felt really pain, pain in was when I was doing some like Swiss ball movements. Luckily, I was able to actually get some footage over there. I got like my first three exercises that I did, and also when I heated my leg and stuff like that to warm it up. Um, but then my last two I didn't get, which were some bridges where I, no, it wasn't my it was. No, it was when I was on the ground and I was doing some Swiss ball thing. So you put your legs in the ball and then you curl them up. So I was feeling some pain a little bit underneath my knee when I was like uh, clenching it together. So that's something I need to work on. And then also um, we did some stabilization where I stood on one leg and I could throw a ball at a wall and catch it just for it to help stabilize my knee and get it back ready to shoot and fire. Um, in other practices but that I didn't have any problems with uh, those are only two I didn't record so luckily I was able to actually actually get some footage happy about that um, this GoPro I don't know if you saw the time lapse but this GoPro like it's it's really great because not of my phone before like I wasn't sure if things are in shot but the, the GoPro shoots so wide that I can really see everything so I'm really happy that I'm able to use this and it's also really small my phone it's really noticeable sometimes so with my GoPro I'm able to 
to all the things that I want to without making it stand out and stuff. So, um, school's about to start pretty soon, so I gotta go get my stuff on really quick, gotta change, and yeah, go head off to my first class. So, I'll record a little bit, but I'll talk to you when I start heading over to a practice. See you guys in a bit. Hey guys, unfortunately I didn't record when I got back from um, the tr when I got back from school before I went to training. So I, I kind of just rushed. I got a little bit more time right now. I got 20 minutes till, uh, 20, 20, 25 minutes till I gotta get back to lunch. Uh, but uh, I just want to say that I did the warm-up for like 30 minutes. I felt pretty good, uh, but I still, of course, felt pain in my knees when I was passing the ball on my right side. So I had to step out after that. Uh, but it's gotten a lot better, I think. The sprinting felt a lot better. I wasn't have, having too many problems. So yeah, um, I just I said again after that. It's feeling good right now, but it's also feeling pretty sore from all the exercises. So I'm just gonna take a shower and stuff and then and go to lunch. And then in the afternoon, I have to go to another training session. Probably not gonna do anything there since it's super sore right now, but I might do my own personalized thing like pass against the wall, still getting those touches in. So, um, disappointed I can't play, but still, gotta keep my head up. It's gonna get better pretty soon. I'll be back in the field in no time. So, I'm gonna start getting ready, start heading back to school, and I'll talk to you guys a little bit after school before I head off to the training. See you guys. Hey guys, uh, I just did some work, finish up editing one video I'm gonna upload later. Um, but I'm about ready to go over to the trainers and start getting heated up and stuff and get ready to do some workouts and stuff before um, the practice usually starts at 5.30, but I'm probably not going to play in that. Um, like I said, I should, I should just rest up and hopefully I'll be able to play. We have a scrimmage on the weekend, so I want to work up and rest for that so I can play in that. Uh, but right now I'm going to go over there, do some workouts and stuff. My knee's feeling really sore and I'm feeling really tight and stuff right now because of all the extra I've been doing. I haven't really done too much stretch stretching there. Hopefully we'll do that now but yeah i'll let you know how it goes afterwards and i'll start walking there and i'll see you guys in a little bit first shot first shot i can't see from i can't i can't go this way but then walk all right john jose has hits the ball big garlic hits it back oh big garlic too strong for the game we're not playing we're rallying Hey guys, it's been a really, really, really long day. Um, my knee's feeling a lot better. Looking forward to tomorrow. Hopefully, I'll be able to do more stuff, but obviously, I can't guarantee how sore I'm gonna be and stuff like that. But it's getting better, I can tell. I'm just gonna ice it before bed. Before bed, I'm gonna take a shower, and of course, I'm gonna go in the mornings early to do some extra work on it. So, um, of course, I can't rush it though. If it's hurting too much, I'm not just gonna push through it. I could somehow make it worse, or not even make my knee worse, but so I can tender my ability in other muscles. If I'm not playing how I should be, my body's not playing right, then that can hurt something else. So I just gotta take my time with it, but also make sure that I'm getting on the field as fast as I can. So yeah, I'm happy with that. I also posted another video, and then I also got all my homework done. So I'm feeling ready to go. I'm getting to bed early so I can wake up early. I'm gonna get to bed at like 9.30, so I'm waking up at six, I'll get like eight and a half hours of sleep, which is pretty good. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please comment, like, subscribe. Um, it helps a lot more than you guys know, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.